What's up guys, I'm NBA Shooting Coach Dave Love and in this video, I wanna show you how you can finally break whatever habit is holding you back as a shooter and become the kind of shooter you've always wanted to be. And if you wanna make sure that you get all the information from a real NBA shooting coach that works with real NBA players, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Players have all kinds of different habits, and if you can learn this simple idea, you're going to be able to apply it to just about any habit within your shot to become more consistent. The idea that we're gonna focus on is the idea of deliberate practice. Now let's imagine that the habit that you're struggling with is getting your feet wide enough apart that you can stop the negative energy. All we wanna be able to do is isolate that habit. If I asked you to just stand with your feet wider apart, you would be able to do that because the environment, the situation that we're doing it in, is very simple. Or if you're struggling with the habit of getting your guide hand off the ball, if all I asked you to do was stay very close to the hoop, start very slowly, and take your guide hand off the basketball, hold that position for a second and then shoot, you would be able to do that. Again, because the situation is very simple. That's what I mean when I talk about isolating a habit. Simplifying this situation as much as necessary so that you can actually do whatever it is you want to do differently. And then make sure that you practice enough that you actually get good and comfortable with this new habit. Now, when it comes time to apply it into a game, what we don't want to do is jump right from form shooting to a game situation. We want to take small little baby steps forward. If you were starting stationary with your feet nice and wide apart and you're getting comfortable and good with that, then you may apply that into a setting where there's a little bit of movement into the shot and you have to hold yourself accountable to getting your feet wide apart. Or if you're working on getting your guide hand off the ball and you've been in an isolated situation, now we might complicate it by getting the ball moving slowly, taking our guide hand off the ball and shooting with our guide hand coming off the ball. Whatever it is you're working on, you have to make sure that you are holding yourself accountable to actually doing that thing and then slowly taking baby steps towards a game environment. If any point you feel like you can't execute the habit you're working on in that situation, you just need more practice in a slightly easier situation. And the positive thing is, now you know exactly in what way you need to practice. So stop asking your body to just be able to learn to do something differently in a very complicated situation. Teach it in a simple environment and then slowly make the environment more like a game as you get better at that isolated skill. Now, if you wanna see how I isolate all kinds of different shooting habits, make sure you click the link below to get my shot development system bundle. In those three programs, I'm gonna show you how to isolate some of the most common shooting habits and then layer drills to build better habits so that you can make more shots. Now, don't forget, go into the comments, let me know what you wanna learn about, like this video, and then go subscribe to my channel.